out of y'all. It's Ryan from Arnie Music, <laughs> deep in the heart of my house. Yeah. <clears throat> uh, today's Monday. It's my day off. My really one day off. And I uh, just thought I'd give you a little quick video. Yeah. So I've been trying a few things for the home practice rig, right? I, uh, I brought home an orange micro terror. Which is awesome. Um, I like those a lot. Now the thing is with the orange micro, it sounds fantastic through like a 1x12 or a 4x12 uh, or a 212. Sounds sick through a 412. Um, through the little orange PPC 108, um, this is my criticism uh, as an orange dealer, and I love orange, but my criticism is uh, the little 1x8 cab is kind of the weak link in that setup. Uh, you know, it might be interesting to try the Micro Terra with, say, like a Panama 1x10, uh, which I might do as a Panama dealer. So, anyways, it wasn't quite cutting it for me for the home practice. So, I brought home this. Ew. <laughs> so excited. Yeah, we've been Jet City dealers since the very beginning. Uh, Jet City started in 09, and Arnie Music officially opened its doors January 1st, 2010, even though we were kind of working behind the scenes in 2009. Uh, I like the Jet City stuff, I really do. Um, they made some changes in the last uh, year, about a year ago, probably a year, year and a half ago, um, where they made kind of a deal with Musician's Friend, and you, Musician's Friend is sort of the exclusive dealer of Jet City Amps now. Um, which, you know, sometimes companies do things that uh, we as dealers have no control over and we just, it is what it is. So, um, since I'm not a Jet City dealer anymore and neither is anybody else, <laughs> kind of didn't make a lot of sense to keep the, the JCA20 at the shop since I can't really sell them. Um, but it is a really nice amp, so I brought it home. So it's the home rig for now. For now because I've got my eye on some other things but in the meantime it's a tasty home tone that's what it is So there's a little bit of my home rig of the moment, which is uh, which is all right. I've got a couple, my eye on a couple of other amps that I'm interested in. May get some of the Panama stuff, and uh, I like to get the Conqueror in. Seems pretty cool. My buddy Ike over at Flipside Music is also a Panama dealer, and he's gotten some more of their amps in than I have. Up at this point, I've just carried the cabs, which are some really really sweet cabbages. But uh, yeah, that. I've also had my eye on the PV6505 Mini tiny thing because Fluff did a video about it. I'm like, holy crap, that's awesome. I'm not a PV dealer, but uh, hmm. see, it's, it's conflicting because I want to, <laughs> of course, carry my own stuff. You know, whatever brands that we carry at the shop, obviously, that's stuff that I like to play on personally. Um, but there's a lot of other great gear out there. But. Um, too many choices with gear sometimes. So, anyways, just thought I'd give you guys a little insight into uh, the home rig <laughs> at the moment and just share some with you guys. So, appreciate all the support. Thank you guys and gals so much for watching our videos and being supportive of our little mom and pop shop deep in the heart of Texas. And uh, yeah, man, we're we're really happy at the moment with our 
our new our new place so it's been a long time coming we're just extremely uh, grateful for where we are now thank you guys so much keeps music alive oh devil cat amps devil cat devil cat made in the USA hand wired devil cat same guy says Chris Mitchell guitars CMG devil cat amps mm. really want one of those too so we'll see what happens thank you all so much keeps music alive